Hello and welcome to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you to my day ones, twos, and threes. Thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in. That means well. Thank you so very much. Appreciate you all and welcome, welcome, welcome. This video is for entertainment purposes only. So everything is alleged, some it's not. And the fair act use is in my description box, y'all. So let's get to it, y'all. Let's get to it. Um, first, I'm going to say happy Saturday. I hope everybody is having a wonderful day. Please stay safe and all that good stuff. Please stay aware of your surroundings and watch the company that you keep. Okay, y'all? So let's get to it. Let's get to it. Um, we about to go deep into this whole finesse two times. Okay, y'all? Because something is definitely a brewing. Um, word on the street is finesse two times is receiving, you know, all kind of threats, all kind of stuff. Okay, y'all. Um, since this has taken place and fell in this lap, y'all. And we got to talk about it. I had to do the numbers. I just, I had to go in on this part right here. So we're going to talk about his whole lifestyle, how he's living, everything. Because I'm going to tell y'all this. And I've been saying this for the longest. I, my day ones, two, three, you all know. Um, they take you out how you live. This is how they take you out. Okay? Like they did Mo 3. And, and they make it a joke. They make a joke of it, y'all. So, you got to think about how he's living as well when it comes down to um, finesse two times and how they're going to try to line him up. Okay, y'all, because this is what it's looking like right now that he's being lined up. Okay, so let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Now, Mama Bear has been coming forward trying to stay her case. And like I told y'all, um, she only made things worse because she confirmed that this case did happen. And, you know, she gave the address. We I wrote down there with him the 201 popular and all of this stuff is weird because 201 was popping up in his numbers, too. But, y'all, this whole thing don't make no sense. But she's scared for her baby right now. And I'm going to tell y'all why. Um, when you rap a certain, you know, when you rap about certain things and about that lifestyle, then these are the people that is drawn to you. So, the people that's listening to Finesse Two Times and his hardcore, you know, music, um, they're hardcore too. And they live by certain creeds and rules, okay? And one of their rules is no snitching. And um, this is coming out, and this is affecting him in a major way right now, y'all. Um, Finesse, two times, is not going to even be able to go do shows in a minute to even make money. Because he is going to be so scared to even go out and make money. Okay, y'all? Um, it's getting serious. It's getting serious right now. And I told y'all that this was coming. When I read his, you know, I keep saying read. When I did his numbers before, y'all, I'm telling y'all, I said this, that something is a brewing. I didn't know when, who, how, whatever. But now you see what's taking place right now. Okay. We are about to go deep. Um, Jake, 1090 Jake, y'all. Um, I'm, I'm, this is just a question. Did he get paid? Did he get paid to do it, y'all? Did he get paid to help line finesse two times up? This, I'm just asking a question. That's it. I ain't saying he got paid. I'm not saying did he, y'all. I want to know. Because it just seems like this just came out of the blue. And I'm like, why now? We know that Finesse been going back and forth with J. Prince Jr. They'll act like they back made up, like they he gonna be, you know, mob task for life. And then they back, you know, subliminals when, on their messages and all of that stuff back and forth. It's been a lot of back and forth going on with, you know, uh, him, them and mob tabs. Him and mob tabs, y'all. A lot. And, you know, like I told y'all... The more street pharmacy stuff that he started doing and sipping, the more, you know, um, his old self comes out. And he don't, um, that old self that comes out, don't take no mess off of, you know, no montage, no nothing. Okay, y'all? So, um, 
They can't control him anymore. Is what I'm trying to say. So if you need mob tasks, because, okay, you didn't sign up with him now. You didn't sign that contract. With, you with the family now, okay? But you're not acting right. So now this puts him back in his place to feel like he need mob ties to protect him. But at the same time, does mob ties even care if somebody take you out, if you too scared to go on the stage and make some money for them? Because if you ain't making no money doing no shows, then um, they don't have no need for you. They can cash in their contract. You know what you signed when you signed with all these labels? The insurance policy contract, y'all. So he is stuck in between a rock and a hard place right now, y'all. And my thing is, my question is, why did this guy... It make you wonder, like, because I'm going to just put it like this. If it was somebody that knew Finesse two times and they had this dirt on him, you would think that they would get some money out of it by, like, um, you know what I'm saying, y'all? This Finesse two times. You would think that they somebody would have reached out to him, like, you know, we're going to release this if you don't give us this amount of money and you can have, you know, blah, 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 this paperwork and we are, you know, we are sending a letter that we won't put this out. I think if somebody came at him that way, he probably would have paid the money. Because he clearly did not want this out. And his mama didn't want it out either, y'all. Because you can see that she is highly upset, okay, that it's out. This has ruined Finesse's career. Ain't no street codes that's going to support him like that anymore. And anywhere that he go, he's a target right now. If he try to do shows... Or whatever, y'all. He gonna have to fully be, you know, put vests and all kind of stuff on to perform now. Not just wear it in no outfit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, y'all? The real to ride around in. So you gonna have to be doing a show in your suit, okay? Suited and booted. And you're gonna have the right, have to have the right security right now. And you know, um, when they need to be out there like that, that takes up a lot of their money, y'all. It does. But if he want to keep that money flowing, he going to have to do it. But my question is, who sent 1090 Jake at him? Okay. And remember I was telling y'all about the red. Remember I was telling y'all about that? When I looked up 1090 Jake, he had on like a red, um, you know, scarf. And they say that's for the, you know, the red street association. Okay, y'all. So, uh, was this the red that I was talking about a, a couple of videos back saying that the red is going to come in now? Because you see the, the, the things are changing now. And I'm wondering what everybody's signs are too. I haven't done it yet, but I'm wondering now. Because remember, I was telling y'all about you got to keep up with the astrology of the people that's coming out in the news. Yes, y'all. And who stands to gain the most from this, y'all? Everybody that he signed to. Stands to gain right now if he's taken out. This is, I'm just hoping that, you know, he paying attention. Okay, from what I'm about to tell him. Because these numbers, people say these numbers don't lie. And it was a lot of stuff came up. Even his girlfriend's stuff was coming up, y'all. Okay, which it should because of the fact that, you know, the way he's living. They take you out by the way you're living. Okay. And I want y'all to pay attention to how he's living. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. I want y'all to pay attention to that. Now, Jay Prince, them, he ain't get all of them islands and all that stuff for nothing. And his sons is trying to come up in his same footsteps of, you know, manhandling folks. Y'all. Extort, ex, extort, whatever you call it, y'all. You know what I'm trying to say. I've been sipping. Okay, <laughs> I had a little sip. Y'all. Who stands to gain? After these papers coming out. And I'm going to tell y'all this. Extortion, extortion, extortion. Um, Was they trying to extort money out of him? 
And was they going to use this against him? And was he not having it? I, I mean, I don't know. We don't know. We just know that all of a sudden, this paperwork come to light. And um, it's, it's ruining him right now. And it just seems like it, this was some inside stuff, y'all. It seems like it was his inner circle that pulled this card right now. He has a target on his back right now. Right after he leave Houston and move away, now he has the world on his back. All the street associates. This is their creed, no snitching. Okay? I still don't think Gunna is out the woods, to be honest with y'all. I think they just letting things die down with him. And if he let his guards down too much, they're going to get him. Because the, everybody's still looking at him like he is a snitch. So this was the worst jacket to put on him. And he's so street, y'all. I'm just saying. This was the worst jacket. And word on the street is the paperwork is real. This is what they're saying. This paperwork is legitimate paperwork that happened in 2008, y'all. Now, before I get started and get deep into this stuff, I wanted to stop for a second and talk about this. Because for some reason, I feel like this is connected. Just because y'all don't see everybody there don't mean that everybody ain't rocking with them as well. Okay, y'all? Because there's a lot of secret meetings that go on too. Because they don't want everybody to know who they all working with. That's just my personal opinion. Okay? Now, the reason that I brought this up, this white party, is the simple fact that um, every time they have a gathering like this, Something happens afterwards. It's like, it's like they're having a big meeting after they finish partying. <laughs> okay, y'all? Or doing the partying, you know, had a meeting first and then party. With every, come out and party with everybody else. You know, like on The Godfather. Okay, y'all? Um, what's that, what, what do they have a brewing right now, y'all? Okay? What do they have a brewing? Because it's something. And it's for someone. Okay, y'all, somebody's number that came up, and I think it's more than one, because I think this month is going to be a doozy, y'all. I got, you know, it's just, this is the same month that they released, you know, uh, Renaissance last year. Okay, set um 729 or something like that, that she released the album. So, you know, it's a lot happening this month. Okay, y'all. Um, Wow. What do they have in store? And they had the biggest, the biggest, um, you know, Illuminati devil worshippers there whatsoever. Okay. They had all of the devil worshippers there. Okay, y'all. Um, the biggest ones. Wow. They had people that had made sacrifices there. Quavo, he already made his sacrifice, so he didn't move up a notch. And, you know, apparently, you know, I'm just saying, y'all, Offset ready to go with him up that notch. Because it's looking like that, you know, <clears throat> excuse me, y'all, that takeoff was sacrificed. So some people are there getting their flowers because they did they, they what they needed to do. Get somebody at a, you know, location. Location is very important. Remember I talked about that one more three. You get somebody to a location and everything is, everybody's set to play their part, then people get away with taking people out. And everybody that's involved don't go down. They have, you know, fall guys that will go in there and do this time in their circles. If you're not willing to do that, then, you know, some people is just, they not, you know, they are not accepted. But this is what some people in this inner circle is about. If a push come to shove and you have to do some time, you're going to do that time. And you can be, you you down with the brotherhood. And y'all see that now. Look at the people that's locked up for Mo3. Look at, the, well, he ain't locked up for Mo3. They, he, they locked up for other things. But look at the people that they have locked up for allegedly something else. And it's, they in there for something else. Okay? But they're supposed to be the fall guys. Think about that. And everybody's talking about this one. Lord, oh, Lord, oh, Lord. Everybody's talking about this one right here. Look how this guy is all up on him. There he is. 
he, his stuff is touching his butt right now. His pack of whacker is up against the back of him right here with him in the middle like an Oreo. I had to put an Oreo cookie up there just to let y'all see what he looked like to me. It was just like a reverse. He's the, you know, the cream in the middle. <laughs> He's the cream in the middle, y'all. Is that what the white party is about now, y'all? The cream in the middle. Because this is what it seems like, y'all. Everybody in the industry is getting turned out. And y'all, I, I start running the numbers on this guy that's hugging them and stuff like that that gave the party. Oh, my goodness, y'all. So much stuff was coming up. We'll do that in another video. But y'all, Lord, oh, Lord, oh, Lord. Mm, mm, mm. The industry is pitiful now. And like I said, let's get back to finesse in a minute. But that white party, they have meetings, allegedly, in them white parties. And things go down after they have those meetings, y'all. I'm just saying. Now, I want y'all to think about the word white. Because if you look up white in numerology, and it, you can see 1111 at the bottom. You see the 33 on there, too. Um... <clears throat> When you put um, white in numerology, um, doves, doves pop up. And y'all know what doves is used for. Usually when somebody passes away, they release the doves or something like that. Um, yeah, crips also came up under white, okay? Um, so I'm just wondering, you know, are they, I'm just saying. The doves, the crips, um, the horse. And y'all know that they have like horses at funerals and stuff too. And remember I told you about, you know, Renaissance came out this month last year. And she she was riding all them horses. Remember y'all? Um, Beyonce and Jay-Z was at that white party too. Okay, y'all? So I just want y'all to pay attention to uh, some stuff. Because a lot of Beyonce, Jay-Z and them stuff was popping up in these numbers too. A lot of stuff like that. They names or... Beyonce knows something weird. It, it just was popping up. Now, I want you to pay attention to um, when you put in white party. I want you to pay attention to the 83 that pops up, y'all. And that's the murder by numbers. Okay, y'all? 83. And I want you to pay attention to that number 37. Because 37 popped up a lot, too. 83 and 37. Just kept popping up. And that's the murder by numbers. And um, this 37, I forgot what that was for. Let me look that up real quick while I'm on here with y'all. 37. Let's see what comes up under 37. Because I ain't paying no attention to this one. Um, trees, lots of trees, y'all. Hell. Hmm. Wow. Just get straight to the point, huh? Houston pops up too. Houston. And ain't that's what Jay Prince them is from Houston, y'all. Um, what else? What else? Los Angeles is on there. We already know that's the capital of where it been going down at. Seal. Remember, I was telling y'all about the seven seals or something like that. I was telling y'all about the seals, the Jesuits, um, spirits pops up. The N word. Y'all know that N word. That's popping up. Um, hmm. So let's keep going. Let's keep going. So let's get back to finesse. Because I got a feeling that he is about to be, you know, if he let his guards down, they, they're going to get him. I'm just, just saying. I just feel like that's going to happen if he let his guards down right now. So he better get his security right. And really sit back and start investing some of his money and some stuff that's going to make some money. Um, because he ain't going to be able to do too many shows in a minute, y'all. I don't even think so. With, with, with what's coming out right, right now, the allegedly the threats, um, he ain't going to be able to keep doing shows. Seriously. And y'all already see that they was getting hit up. You know, the, every time you do a show now, the place get hit up. Okay? Um... I want y'all to pay attention to Mama Bear, too, because as long as he doing dirt, it's okay. Okay? It's okay when he doing dirt. I ain't seen her come up one time, y'all. I haven't heard 
anything from Mama Bear about, you know, how he's out here living with this kid that, you know, he then took from somebody off the street. Yeah, he helped the child by taking him off the street. But look what stuff that he's putting him around right now. And just because he was around it before doesn't mean that he still should be around it. And he's that age. And some stuff should be just off limits to him. He shouldn't be just in the midst of everything that they're doing. Okay, because it would be sad to hear that some some went down. Like y'all see all of these hittings is taking place at his concerts. And this child be caught in the middle of that. You haven't heard her say anything about none of that, y'all. And she talked about she want to get a page now, okay? So she can talk about, not my baby, my baby, we ain't no snitch. And now it's coming out that the paperwork is true. So she's, not only is her son a snitch, she's a liar too, okay, y'all? Because she knew, she know, that's my baby. She know what was said and all of that stuff. She probably was the one that encouraged it. I'm just being completely honest. Ain't nobody can tell their baby, you better not say nothing, baby. You do them 100 years with them. Ain't nobody going to do that. Ain't nobody about to tell their child nothing like that. Okay, y'all? So, I don't think so. I think that she just made herself look bad. She is in the same boat as, um, what's his name? The one in the hospital, Jamie Foxx and his daughter. Okay, y'all? Jamie Foxx's daughter opened her mouth and made stuff worse. And you don't want to hear from her no more because she's a liar. So now we know she's one. Okay, y'all? So Mama Bear is all in her feelings right now because she thinks that that gravy train is about to end soon. Everybody in the family big and him taking care of everybody. Some of that stuff going to have to slow down now because he can't go everywhere he, he want to go now. And she knows it's serious. She knows that's a jacket that he did not need on his back. So, yeah, y'all, it's it's serious. And like I said, I'm just surprised that you never come forth and say nothing about this child that he have, you know, out here allegedly doing the trees and rolling and all kind of stuff, hanging out, you know, with all of these, you know, coochie mamas, y'all, you know, that's over his age and all the stuff. And it's just the lifestyle that he has this child around is is. Is no child should be like that. He's a kid. Let him grow up. Let him, you know, live as a child instead of trying to just make him grow up that fast. He's so young. It's just like Beyonce daughter that's going on tour and hanging out all around all of these she-he's and all this stuff. Um, let that child live, you know, and go hang out with some of my friends and you know what I'm saying, y'all? And do some child things instead of trying to make her grow up so fast. So I'm just saying, why she ain't saying nothing about him, you know, mingling and tingling, got three women living in a house with him. Why she ain't have no opinion on none of this? But now, you know, when a shit of is hitting the fan, a cut, okay? Because I, I know she didn't think that that money was just going to just keep rolling and he don't have to sacrifice or do something that they want him to do. And we all know that he don't rock that way, y'all. The Fruity Pebble, right? Allegedly. So far. He don't rock that way. So he has that against him already because mostly all the rappers that don't go that route, they're pushed to the side. Okay? So he already has things against him. And then you were already getting into it now with the people that you signed these contracts with. You getting you didn't moved away and all that, trying to get away from them and this and that and this. Um, they not feeling him like that anymore. The team is not feeling it. And like I told y'all, um, they get you how you live. Okay, so let's just go into this for a second because I've been talking about this. You know, I started off playing and it's weird because I do this with a lot of stuff. Okay, um, but I started off playing saying that, you know, um, finesse two times and history, which is Eastwick, you know, because I got it from this movie right here. If y'all ever watched this movie, this movie is tripped out. But at the same time, his downfall was these women that he wanted. This was his downfall. Everybody had their opinion about him and the three women, and people talked about it, and, and then everybody just let it go, whatever. If they that's what they want to do, don't nobody care. But people talked about it. Some a lot of bloggers was defending him, you know, acting like it was a good thing. You know what I'm saying? Because of course the guy's gonna be like, you know, thinking he's living that life. But um, it's a lot of things come with that. 
Okay? A lot of things come with that. And then on top of that, he's still not happy with the three he got because he's still trying to come at other people. So it's like this is his weakness. And this could be what they use against him. Okay, y'all? A lot of weird stuff was coming up in their numbers. And like I said, in this movie, it, it, and, and when I was looking at one of his laughs, he started looking weird like this. I'm not lying, y'all. I was looking at him and he was making faces and I was like, it made me think about Jack Nicholson. And I was like, oh my goodness. And y'all see how he started looking at acting when he has, you know, had a little something, something. Okay, y'all? Um, I want y'all to pay attention. Now, another thing I want y'all to pay attention to is the names that he called them. He called, uh, he said, finesse two times, um, chocolate, caramel, or red. Long is she about that bread. Okay, so that makes you wonder, you know, you start thinking about that little Kim stuff again with um, Biggie. Is he, you know, um, gimping them? Y'all know with a P. Is he gimping them? I told y'all, he talked about long as they about that bread. So I don't know. Or is he, you know, it could be working the parties. You know what I'm saying, y'all? The swerving girls. Ain't no telling. Ain't no telling, y'all, okay? Because y'all know that a lot of rappers is into this. And this is what they're doing. But this is the same. If you think about the three witches of Eastwick, you have Michelle Pfeiffer. And Michelle Pfeiffer, uh, I think she was the caramel one, okay? I'm just guessing that maybe she was the caramel one, okay? Um, Suzanne Sarandon, I think she was red because she had the red hair. And um, Cher was chocolate, I think, okay, y'all? I think she, I would say she would be the chocolate, okay, y'all? So we're going to talk about each and every one of the females that he's with, you know, what do y'all think? We're going we're gonna to talk about it. So, Finesse Two Times' real name is Ricky Hampton. Birthday is June the 10th, 1992. Okay, so we're about to talk about it. And these are his labels that he signed to. Ingrooves, Atlantic Records, rap a -Lot, and, and uh, I heard he was signed to Money Back Yo as well. Okay? So, I don't see that on there, but that's what I heard. But look at what Finesse comes to. I put Finesse in, y'all. And 322 popped up right here, just like the skull and bones. And if you flip this 32 to 23, this is the year of 23. So I thought I found that interesting that skull and bone numbers was popping up in his name and his birthday. Okay, y'all? It was popping up. So when you put that in, I was like, okay. So... When I put in The Witches of Eastwick, which, which is the name of the movie, 323 popped up again. So there you go, that 322 again. And not only do you have the 322, you have the 88, the Infinity Links on here, which is same thing tied to Mob Ties now, Infinity Links. Just like the Infinity Links, when they did that memorial, they put that big old Infinity Link on there, like you tied to Mob Ties forever. For helping us set this up okay they got some big money off the of takeoff being taken out okay not only did they sell that label but y'all gotta think about it they had him in a big insurance he's a big celebrity so they got they got paid off of um takeoff they did and you already see how quavo been moving up so y'all pay attention to this um it's a lot of numbers up here that's suspect this, this 322 is up here. This 88 is up here. You don't count the zero. So 38, that's the murder by numbers right there. That's 38. And then you got the 11 right here. Because you, you take off the zero. So y'all, um, this whole line right here. It screams. Y'all just keep watching. Just keep watching. Is this how they going to take him out? Now this popped up too. And it was a sentence. So I had to, um, when I put in the Witches of Eastwick, um, a lot of stuff popped up. Um, Blood, Moon, Sacrifice popped up. Mega Millions, Jackpot popped up. Remember I told y'all they always pop up when somebody don't have no kids or whatever, and then they leave all this money and the family get it. It's like a jackpot for the family after they're gone. Remember I told y'all that? 
So Mega Millions jackpot popped up under that as well. Um, Demise and Destruction popped up. And Young Dolph popped up. And y'all know that Young Dolph was set up by women, right? They said women did that. And this sentence popped up too. It says, how do you measure a snake? It's a question. How do you measure a snake? This popped up in his, under the Witches of Eastwick, y'all. Okay? And you see the, I told y'all, the same numbers. Now, Young Dolph popped up. And July 27 popped up, too. This date popped up, July 27. And Young Dolph name popped up. It came up under um, Adolph Robert Thornton Jr. That's what popped up. But the date, exactly his birthday, popped up, too, under the Witches of Eastwick. So, the only thing that I could think about was we know that he was a sacrifice. We do know that Dolph, young Dolph was a sacrifice, but you know, where it is, a bunch of women got together and, you know, put this play in motion. The guys just went along with it. So if you think about it now, I'm just saying y'all, they use, they did the same thing with Mo three. They used a the female, you know, her location Okay, y'all. They used Dolph, a female location. She was the location, a female. Okay, um, June tenth, nineteen ninety two. This is um. Let me go back. Let me go back. Okay, so June tenth, nineteen ninety two. This is um uh, finesse birthday. <clears throat> And look at the numbers that's coming up under there. Okay, y'all. Um, I want y'all to pay attention to the 44. Okay, that's that Beyonce number again. Okay, y'all. The three sixes at the top in reduction. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. The um 37 again. This 37 gonna keep popping up, y'all. This 37 is it has a really subliminal meaning to this 37. So remember this 37. Um three two two. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. Skull and bones again. Three, two, two. So, there it is again. It popped up in his birthday. Now, I want y'all to pay attention to this 37. I'm telling y'all this 37 popped up everywhere. If you put in snitch, 37 comes up, okay? Not only do 37 come up, 83 or the 38 murder by, okay, come up. 217. Came up on there twice, which is Jordan's birthday. I keep telling y'all, the year 23, Skull and Bones, Jordan. Um, 37 came up in 1090 Jake, too, y'all. And it came up four times. <laughs> four times, y'all. It came up up here in the top and at the bottom twice. 73, and it came up 37 twice at the top. And guess what else popped up in 1090 Jake, y'all? That go that 38 again, ain't it, y'all? Just like Snitch, 83, 83. Um, same thing, 38. Murder by numbers. It's in 1090 Jake. This is why I'm like, wow, this is weird that this lining up like this, y'all. This is weird. Was he was he paid? Now they're gonna 37 again, y'all. When you put in Jack Nicholson, who was the star in that movie of the three witches of Eastwood? Okay. When you put him in, this is what you get, that 37 again. And you also get that 217 again, which is 23, Michael Jordan birthday. Okay, y'all? I keep telling y'all, I keep throwing Michael Jordan in here. 33 is coming up in here if you take off the zero. Now, when you put this his name in, and I didn't put all that in because it was just too much, y'all. But as soon as you put in Jack Nicholson, Beyonce Carter comes up. Um... In his time of dying comes up. The tree of life comes up. Um, shot and killed pops up. Okay. Satan laughing pops up, y'all. And guess what else pops up under Jack Nicholson? Deal with the devil. Like you made a deal with the devil. So what him making a deal with mob task, a deal with the devil, y'all. Ask yourself this question. Because I do believe my personal opinion. Okay that they have something to do with that paperwork coming out, y'all, and somebody really close to him. 
I truly believe that. Now, if you put in Michelle Pfeiffer, okay, she's one of the witches of Eastwick. Um, she's the karma one. The doors of perception pops up, y'all. That's what pops up under hers. Doors of perception. Okay? That's just like I was telling y'all about the book. And it was about the, um, as above, so below. Yeah. Um, Baton Roof, Louisiana popped up too. And that made me think about Boosie or something. I think that's where he's from. I think, y'all. Okay? I'm wondering, do she got any family from there? Or is she tied to anybody? The karma one. That's in his, you know, circle. I'm just, just saying, y'all. If we're going to do this by the numbers, just think about it, okay? Um, These people are sick. Remember I told y'all? <laughs> Remember I pulled that up before? This came up in one of my other, um, doing the numbers. These people are sick. Um, Take off dice game popped up, y'all. And this was under the karma one. So if if he has three females that he call red caramel and chocolate, you know, finesse two time. So did was caramel there when takeoff got taken out, y'all? Do she know something about that? Because why is this coming up under the, her name, y'all? Her. Um, alcohol intoxication. And that pops up. Too much sippy sippy going on. Um, and reptilian bloodline pops up under the caramel one so um hmm that's strange susan sarandon you see that 83 pops up again y'all they go that 83 they go 9112 y'all pops up under hers but they go that 38 and 83 that murder by numbers again so when you put her name in assassination pops up and scripted event pops up like you know everybody is put him to play like she'll be there when it goes down and everything is going to be scripted they're going to tell you what they want y'all to know you know what they want to tell y'all okay basically that she is going to be there when it goes down so this is red okay whichever one he called red okay y'all so y'all it was some tripped out stuff coming up here now when i put share in Four, four, four popped up. Y'all know that's Beyonce them number. Four, four, four. That popped up. Okay. Um, th 32, 23, that popped up again. And I went on and put her real name in too. Because I, you know, wasn't nothing coming up under just Cher. So her real name is Sherilyn Sarkeesian, something like that, y'all. And I found this interesting that this popped up because there's a storm coming popped up. Remember, I was telling y'all about the storms and tempests. Anytime it's some type of, you know, they start talking about the waters and stuff like that. That is something to brewing. So there's a storm coming popped up. Okay, y'all. Um, Freemasonic order popped up. Girls, girls, girls popped up. So he, he had girls, girls, girls all around the house. So that popped up. Uh, uh, first degree. First degree, taking somebody out, that popped up. Friday the 13th also popped up, y'all. Okay? But I want y'all to pay attention to that 111. There's that 111, and there's that 44 that I just said a little while ago. And there's that 201, you know, where he said, she said that her son went to 201 Popular Street when, you know, he got arrested and he didn't say nothing. This is what she said, y'all. There it is. I managed to put that one up, huh? There's a storm coming. 87 264 1584. Yep, there it is. 87 1584 That popped up. So then I went to, because this is what Comic Ken folks say. They always go to the news report, y'all, and put in how they phrase stuff. So this is what they phrased on the news report, you know, or the, like, you know, media reports about, you know, finesse two times snitching. It said recent claims of snitching. So I typed that in. As soon as I typed that in, lo and behold, that go to 246 again and 111. There it is again. And then there's her name. You got the 264 and the 111 over there as well. So I was like, whoa, okay. 
So it's starting to line up like it should. That it's something a brewing, and he better watch himself with these girls too. Now, another thing that um, I put in was the release date of the movie. Because it was put, the release date was June the 12th. And he's born on June the 10th, back two days before this date. Okay, y'all? But not the same year. But, and I put the release date in. It was some weird stuff coming up under the release date. Did I get everybody? Yeah, I think I got everybody. Did I get chocolate? Okay, we'll go back to him. Okay, so June the 12th in 1987, when you put that in, purple and black comes up. And y'all remember that's what Mo3 had on when he passed away, the purple and the black. So he had that on, and I was like, wow. So then Conspire popped up, and then Poison popped up, then Rapper popped up. Why would Rapper pop up under when the release date of Three Witches of Eastwick was released. But that is what is popping up, y'all. And I was like, whoa. Um, murder popped up. Serial hitters popped up with a K. You know what I'm trying to say, y'all. Serial ones. That popped up. Hate popped up. Mother popped up. Donda popped up. Lilith popped up. And Trees, y'all popped up under June 12th, 1987, okay? And then I put it in another way. I put it in this way, 6 12 1987 that way. And it came up to 34. And I found that odd because something else came up to 34 too. I think it's, um, it's something else had to do with them, came up to 34. But it was a lot of the same things coming up, Lilith, purple stuff like that it was all the same so i thought that was odd okay um snitch i put in snitch because this is what they call him him he's a snitch look at that 73 popped up again okay not only is the 73 popping up again the 83 38 the murder by numbers is popping up again and 217 come up there two times so that's 23 23 okay y'all 23 23 that's michael jordan's birthday so, I just want y'all to pay attention to what's coming up. Um, look at Rat. If you put in Rat, what pops up? That 37 again. And they go to 6666 down at the bottom. But look at that 37 that just keeps coming up, keeps coming up. Um, if you put in Rats, because the reason why I put in Rats with the S is because every time he go live now, this is what they're putting in in his comment section. They put in Rat. They just, you know, threatening him, all kind of stuff that they talking about. I got some cheese for you. They doing all this, y'all. And if you see the 271 is up there again, that 23, Jordan. Then I got the 32 up there. If you flip it, it's 23 too, okay? This 300 is on one of his numbers too. But you also see that 201 again, that popular street where he went down there to the police station. That, that popped up again under rats. I just find this odd, y'all. Do you remember Friday the 13th popped up under something? They go to 13. I find it odd. I truly do. Um, I think he's in trouble, y'all. I think he's in trouble now. Seriously. And it amazes me because he has this chain on with three people hanging. And you got three people staying in your house that, you know, I don't know. They're kind of suspect, y'all. Um, listen to this. This is Ricky Hampton. Okay, I put him in. Of course, the three sixes popped up at the top. Two one seven popped up again, and three one three. Remember that was popping up under Jamie Fox number, and I kept saying three one three keeps popping up. Yeah, so that popped up. Oh, another thing I meant to tell y'all about his birthday, which is his birthday is six ten nineteen ninety two. It equals twenty eight. But um, bye bye was coming up under his birthday. Um, snake bite. And K to the I to the LL was popping up under his birthday as well, y'all. So I had to go on and let y'all know about that. Um, when I put in Ricky Ricky Hampton, um, John Wick 4 popped up, y'all. John Wick 4, y'all know everybody was trying to take him out, y'all. Do you remember I was talking about this? Because a lot of people be saying that 
that's what happened to Mo3. Everybody in the city wanted him out of there. And a lot of people said it about Dolph, too. They wanted him out of there. So, um, yeah, John Wick 4 popped up. And the, everybody was after him. So, um, is this what's going on right now in his life? It seems like everybody is after him because a lot of street associates is not feeling him being no snitch. And y'all got to think about this. He knows some serious secrets to um, mob tasks that they've been doing since he got out. He knows some stuff, y'all. So, I think his life is truly, truly in danger, y'all. Intoxication is popping up. And I told y'all, the more that he sips and the more the street pharmacy stuff that he does, the more out of control that he will get. And I think about how Jack Nicholson was when he was trying to make it back home and they was trying to stop him with all of them, you know, um, richer, witchery stuff they were trying to do to keep him from getting back to the house or trying to take him out. Um, and he was trying to get there to get back to them because he knew that they was doing something to try to line him up. Yeah, y'all. So, um, that popped up. Four horsemen popped up. There were them horses again. And it says four horsemen this time. And Beyonce came out with that new album, I'm telling y'all, last year. And she had different pictures of her on different horses, y'all. Um, Street Pharmacy Overdose. That popped up on, on his, under his name too. Because he don't know how, his limit. Okay, y'all, I'm just putting it out there like that. This is somebody that do not know their limit. And he will continue to, um, you know, you know, just drink or whatever the pain away. Okay. And if it gets to a point where he can't make money and things start getting bad for him, it's a possibility that this is what they'll say. Okay, y'all. How he left, went out or whatever. Okay, y'all. Um, burning house pops up and Richard Pryor pops up. And I want y'all to think about Richard Pryor. Richard Pryor was somebody that was with a lot of women, okay? It's almost just like him. Richard Pryor was doing street pharmacy stuff, just like him. Um, Richard Pryor um, was burning. Remember, he got set on fire or something like that. Um, it says burning house on here under Ricky Hampton, y'all. So, um, is this the house that he built with these females? Is it about to go down? I don't know. It's something up, okay, y'all? Um, this is summer... This is him on a live, y'all. And people are putting a bunch of rats. And they're calling him Finesse 6 9 Rats, 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 rats. And laughing emojis. This is what they're putting on here when he goes live. Okay? He's getting threats all over the place. And people is like, I wish he would come here. Okay? This is what people are saying in different cities and states. Okay, y'all? This is why I say if you get this, if you get to a position like this, stay humble. Don't do people wrong and get to a point where you, you can help somebody and, you know, make your money, make money and don't get involved in no mess like this. This guy got so big headed that um, he just thought that he can do it his way, whatever, whatever. And now it's backfiring on him, y'all. It's backfiring. Here's some more um, rat, 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 rats. They, that's why I put an S on there, y'all. Um, They put some rats on here with a, a weapon behind the rat. Okay, y'all? Like they're going to um, take the rat out. Okay? Take the rats out. I came on this, lat, this just to see the fans' comments. And then he got they BS laughing and something laughing emojis okay so yeah they threatening him they threatening him they put in they put in guns up there y'all um these are more rats we're rats we're rats rat rats rat we're rat rats the rats rats a lot of rats y'all this is what they putting up on his live when he go live right now and he's rapping on the live anyway trying to like just keep rapping and then he look down and see what they saying and then he'll keep rapping. And then he'll look down when he's saying. Then he's looking around because he's inside the car. I think he's getting paranoid too. Okay. Um, This one says, blow your nose or wipe your nose. Wipe your nose. Y'all know what the wipe your nose mean, like take you out. I think that's what they got up right there. And then they got rats, 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 rats. Okay, y'all. 
Then they put, why y'all calling him a rat? Clout chasing, shaking my head. And somebody said, yeah. And then they got rat, 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 rats, 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 rats. And then they put another, um, they got, I got some cheese for you. It says, funny if he was rat, white paper were just barely popping up. Ha, 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 ha. And this, you know, even though they saying something to try to, um, you know, act like they're protecting him. But what they just said, I keep saying it makes all the sense in the world. Why did this paperwork just pop up all out the blue right now? When, you know, he having, you know, little technical difficulties with my task now, allegedly, y'all. Okay. It just seems like, I'm just saying. I'm wondering, did this guy get paid, y'all, to just ruin this guy's life? Because like I said, you, you're messing with the people, the king of extortion. And why wouldn't you come to, to you know, finesse two times and be like, you know, I won't put this information out if you get paid me, you know, to be quiet, blah, blah, blah. Why not get some money out of it? This ain't personal. Like somebody did this on purpose to ruin his life and make put a target on his back so the world can hate him now. Y'all, they want this guy gone now. Okay. Um, somebody put Rickety, Ricky the Rat. Ricky the Rat. Okay. So they're calling him all kind of stuff, y'all. Okay. This is what they're doing. Now let's get back to. Let's get back to, you know, the girls. So, we talked about karma with Michelle Pfeiffer. Now, we're going to talk about just putting karma in, okay? So, when I put that in, this is what popped up. Um, betrayed. Deceive. So, somebody is going to deceive somebody. Somebody is going to betray somebody, okay? Um, somebody is gullible. And Holy Grail popped up, okay? Now, don't ask me. I know Jay-Z got a song called Holy Grail or an album called Holy Grail. But remember what I told y'all, Beyonce and Jay-Z stuff kept popping up in this, okay? So, y'all, who is going to betray who? I'm just saying, y'all. It's finna, it's about to go down in that household. So, is that what, what it means by, you know, um, burning house? Okay, y'all? I'm just saying, this is some weird stuff popping up um red so red is the other one so when i put red in 666 come out like if you write s-i-x 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 that's how it came out 666 666 666 and, re and remember it's 11 on there as well y'all see the 11 the 132 that's some you know some subliminal stuff too um sacrifice popped up and 11 popped up as well, y'all, under red. So, y'all, go figure. Now, chocolate. I want y'all to pay attention to chocolate because that go to 37 again. Now, if I was, ha uh, you know, I wouldn't trust nobody. But if I really was going to be sad and somebody, it would be chocolate. I'm gonna be, uh, From what these numbers are saying with chocolate, um, you got the 37. You got the 44. That's Beyonce number again. That 966 is 666 if you flip it. You got the 38, the murder by numbers, and the 38 up there. It's it, Everything is up there, okay? Um, and I was telling y'all about um, and it, it, 37 equal rat and all that stuff. You know, I was telling y'all that 37 keep popping up. Um, and I was telling y'all about water, the tempest, storms, and stuff like that. Noah's flood popped up. Noah's flood, like... It's something to brew it into in his household. Seriously, y'all. Um, bad blood popped up under chocolate as well. Um, I'm gonna see how I can say this without um saying it. Mingling and tingling with little ones just popped up too. Okay, y'all. Um, afterlife popped up under chocolate as well. The red P to the I to the L L popped up, y'all. And I want y'all to pay attention to the to the red P to the I to the L L. Um that that meant, okay, because y'all remember on the matrix they had the red and they had the blue. 
But to have that red also means that they kept up with your location. Okay, y'all? It meant they kept up with your location. That's how they kept up with you. Through that red one. The P to the I to the L L. Okay? Um, innocence popped up like she got an innocence about her, but um watch out. Um get effed like you put your middle finger up, get effed. That's popped up. And arrogance popped up. And remember, I keep saying that he's very arrogant. Yes, that popped up. And you see that? Look at that 37 again, that 44, that 38. Y'all, uh-uh. Oh no. Oh no. It's something weird about what's popping up under chocolate, y'all. It's very suspect. Okay. Um, location device. That's what that red P to the I L L is. Location. So for that to come up under chocolate, that means chocolate is the one that would be the one that's gonna give out his location. That's the one that's gonna line him up the most okay that's the very important one is the location okay y'all um location device it comes up to nine 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 just like them nines that kept flipping flopping and flipping and flopping okay y'all and a couple of more of these numbers is up there but yes y'all location and this is y'all he better watch yourself and mama bear is scared now y'all but word on the street, that's what's going on. He has a bag on him, pretty much. A free bag at that, y'all. Now, this was one that they didn't even have to pay nobody to try to get at him. To me, this was a free bag. By saying he a snitch made the world. Made the world. All the people that's in street associations, they want to see him now. They want to be the ones to take him the snitch out. This is what's going on right now, y'all. So, y'all, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section. But it's some tripped out stuff that just came out on, the, on these numbers. It really was. Yes, it is, y'all. So, y'all let me know what y'all think. This is tripped out. And I want y'all to also think I'm going to leave y'all with this. That 83 and 38, that murder by numbers that kept popping up, that also equals, you know, 83 and 88. It came up in mob ties. But rap a lot also equals 83. Okay. Evil eye also equals 83. So I just want y'all to pay attention to this. Now, one more thing popped up that was weird to me. Um, I don't know if I don't keep up with him like that. I don't know if he has a pet, a dog, or whatever. I don't know. Because I, I can't tell you which one of the girls pregnant. I don't know which one it is. But they say one of them pregnant and left. I don't even know which one it was. I can't even remember. But um, it says something about when I was doing chocolates. Um, put chocolate in. Um, it says something about a dog. It says something like a dog would save him from her. Or something weird. I was like, what the heck? But I don't know if you have a dog or not. But if he don't, I suggest he go get one. <laughs> it might help him out. I'm just saying, y'all. Anyway, y'all, just let me know what y'all think. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.